Hey, what's up, guys? This is Vinesh, and today we have a new session for the dark mode lovers. So, guys, are you there? Yeah. Anyone listening? Hello. Hi. How are yeah, you? We have, uh, we have a team member from uh, Dark Club, and we will talk with him. So, I am asking to audience that, are you here, guys? Can you hear me properly? Okay. So today we are going to discuss about dark mode. You must have seen that web apps like Facebook and uh, Twitter and all the platforms and even uh, normal websites are now providing the dark mode option to browse their website and uh, uh, to browse the whole platform inside dark mode. So you must have seen that and we will see an example of it also right now. So we have uh, we are here. I will just introduce briefly that this dark mode you can add inside your WordPress website or WordPress blog with a simple plugin called Dark Club. So today we have live with us a team member from the Dark Club WordPress plugin, and we will discuss up, up, discuss about the same plugin. And uh, let's see, let's dive inside. So welcome to our live session. We have Abdul Rauf with us. And he is live with us right now. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you invi uh, for inviting me on your live session. Actually, uh, it's a great pleasure to join with you. Okay. So, Abdul Rauf, uh, let's proceed uh, with the Dark Club uh, WordPress plugin. And uh, quickly, uh, let's start the session, right? Mm, yeah, sure. Start. Okay. So uh, I would like to ask that uh, what is Dark Club? How uh, is it? Uh, how is it to use? Whether we need to be a developer to use or not, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Dark Club is, is a plugin that turn your website uh, on dark mode on with a single click. You have no. Uh, you uh, no, uh, not need uh, any development knowledge. Uh, okay. If you use Dark Loop on your website, it can. Okay. Uh, so it besides not... coding, besides coding, we don't also need some technical knowledge of WordPress, also, right? Yeah, right. You don't okay. need any technical, any kind of technical knowledge. Uh, if you use the Dark Loop for uh, for uh, using Dark Mode on your website. Okay, so I would like you to share your screen and uh, show us that. Uh, what is dark mode in brief on any website and then we will proceed towards the demo and installation of a new website and we will see how it works yeah sure uh, so, uh, before uh, proceeding uh, proceeding uh, i want to describe the company behind the dark loop actually okay. uh, yeah. i behind the uh, why why we uh, create this plugin why so okay. Actually, WP Commerce is the main uh, mother company behind the dark group. WP okay, Commerce so is a software-based company, okay. and it creates the different kinds of WordPress plugin. Yeah, that can uh, that can increase some facilities uh, among the user, so user not uh, uh, get any hassle to uh, not get any hassle to. Uh, uh, if they are not no coding and other things, sometimes they are, are not able to uh, increase uh, uh, add some add some features on their website. So we WordPress dark uh, uh, for the WordPress dark mode. We WP Commerce bring a, a such an excellent plugin called the Dark Loop, and it has the it has proficiency and it has amazing features and it it already gained some popularity and so people uh, people uh, always love it so are you there yeah sorry i can't hear you hello okay now can you hear me yeah I can hear you now. Uh, I just popped out as you were speaking. So uh, the parent company 
uh, has multiple plugins also. So, what are the different plugins that you uh, your company has right now besides Dark Club? Yeah, we have the variations work. We have another uh, ongoing project that will be live uh, very soon. But Dark Club is our main product. The okay. uh, we uh, I just I just introduced Dark Club uh, right now. Uh, inshallah, we will uh, we will introduce our other plugin uh, with you in a few days also. Okay, so uh, let's pro pro proceed and let's uh, show us that uh, what is dark mode and how dark mode dark club can be used on WordPress website. Right? Yeah, sure. So, sure. so you can share your screen right now, right? Yeah, I'm sharing my screen. Okay. So can you share my, uh, can you see my screen? Yeah, I think you, uh, you can sh uh, see my screen. This is the common structure of any website. This is the common structure. And this is the demo website where I already installed uh, our plugin. So. We, without dark loop, we can see the light version of the website. Somebody, uh, somebody already aware of the dark mode and they are trying to add this feature on their website, but they are not, uh, not, uh, not agree with uh, redesign. So what is the solution actually? So if they want uh, dark mode on their website and if uh, they not want to break their current design, then you should proceed with the dark loop. And with the dark loop, you can you can add the dark dark version of the website with the single click like this. If you, I already I uh, I told you that I already installed it here. Again, I will uninstall it and install it again. So yeah, uh, the our audience will. Uh, get a clear idea how I uh, how our plugin work. So I just uh, show here the basic functionality how dark mode work. This is the light version and I just click a single button. It turns dark. Okay, so now proceed with the backend. This is the backend and these uh, are also in a uh, light mode and just i have a menu button just click on it click on it and it turns dark so uh, sorry for the interruption that's it. i just uh, removing this plugin so user can so user can understand how it works Okay, so I have no dark mode in my WordPress right now. You see that this button are gone. So if I want to add the dark mode features on my website, then I should use a dark mode plugin. And now I go to the plugin with, uh, from my dashboard and click to add new and search. Dark loop from here. You see that here is a plugin and then the dark loop light. So I install it. I activate and without any configuration, without any configuration, I just reload my front end and you see that here is a button. It's turned dark. This is, is this very simple? Uh, please uh, show it again. Uh, show it again because uh, your your cam uh, your uh, cam was there and uh, it was not visible. So yeah, yeah. Just switch and switch it back. Yeah. Okay. I just I just install this. 
no setting or i uh, i am not clicking any uh, any setting button from okay uh, so uh, go to that website just go to that website and okay. yeah yeah now uh, from the button you have to switch right yeah okay and you can see the several several setting option from our control panel yeah you see that i am not turning dark mode on our backing it uh, the plugin uh, this plugin sends that i have dark mode on my front end and it automatically turn dark okay now let's see it is a light mode and I, again i refresh the front uh, backing you see that the plugin automatically turn light because it can sense that i not need the dark mode right now so if again i just click uh, make the front end dark mode and uh, just refresh it you see that this dark mode works automatically you can switch anything uh, any time just uh, with one click and from the general setting you can enable front end mode you can enable back end mode you can uh, was dark mode just a minute uh, let me show how let me show how uh, how the dark mode uh, work with the was our mode i make it turn uh, turn it light okay and now i just make my windows os dark okay it is now dark and you see that button is on light mode but website already turned on dark mode this is this function that it enable os our dark mode that means my windows in dark mode so website turn dark mode automatically this is the special feature uh, and very very rich feature uh, from our so, plugin uh, if we set up that if some user is using dark mode inside his operating system either it's windows or mac right uh, and uh, that this website will automatically be switch yes this plugin can sense uh, sense your uh, sense your was was dark mode or light mode and it automatically just uh, you can see that this is my uh, light mode and i just turn the dark mode from my window setting window setting and you see i not click uh, any button it automatically turn dark so it can sense the it can sense the uh was a uh, version it was uh, light mode or dark mode it uh, this plugin is very clever and it has uh it has this feature to uh, turn automatically uh, uh dark mode for your users so i think this special feature will be a very game changer for your website so from the advanced setting this is the pro version you can uh, use the if you uh want some extra features for your website then you can uh, you can uh, go to uh, go to the pro version and then you can uh, uh, enable this function okay so i can choose the swiss version actually this is the swiss version i just save it save changes and reload the front end and it or the button chains and there are several button in free version and there are also uh, so, uh, some uh, exclusive button for the pro version and sometime you uh, can see the tool tip so what is the tool tip just, just let me uh, let me show you this is our mother website uh, website for the for this plugin and you see that how it work just this is how it work 
and when I uh, uh, shift my cursor on this button, you see that toggle dark mode and the tooltip. This is the tooltip setting. And customize switch color. You can customize every switch color with the pro version. Customize switch size, switch position, uh, text, uh, font, uh, font size, switch text, and the switch state on dark mode to above the post or show above the page. Uh, the this is the advanced setting. You will we will uh, get uh, get it from the pro version. So from the color setting, there are three preset color. Three preset color uh, comes with the free version and more uh, more nine. That means I mean 12, uh, 12 color are included in uh, pro version. And you can also change the admin color mode. So I just turn the orange and save change and make it dark. You see that uh, the difference, the color, color palette. So I just change it again in blue. And you see that it is blue. So, and with the pro version, you can use the you can use the logos and uh, and others uh, uh, replace the dark mood image with uh, from, uh, for the logos and also other images. So this is also the pro version. So you can uh, when you turn dark mood dark mood for your website, the dark mood uh, image will replace your logos and also other images in, in uh, that include in your pages and uh, and post so our uh, our dark mood is also compatible with uh, different kinds of uh, different kinds of page builder like the uh, popular like uh, page builder like the visual composer js composer king composer oxygen builder uh, bivar builder or elementor so uh, you have uh, nothing to worry that if I uh, use this uh, dark loop and uh, I'm using the uh, any page builder and is it compatible or is it uh, is the dark loop compatible with uh, with this uh, page builder? Yes, it is compatible. So you have uh, nothing to worry. You can uh, use without any worry and you can test the uh, test the uh, pro, uh, light version. For your website so if you have a great and good store and so good store then uh, you can uh, also use it with your e-commerce or other shop plugin then you can uh, you can uh, go for the pro version and you can include exclude or customize any setting from uh, from uh, from your uh, setting menu Okay, and there are also an option for filter include uh, element. So, with the pro version, you can include or exclude any any class or D that for the developer. If you are a developer, then you know how, how what is the D, what is the class, what is uh, so you can easily find the class name, D name, and you can include the element or exclude that element. element. So with the trigger, you can include pages, include post, and include categories or other things. Still, if you are not satisfied, then you can use your custom CSS with the pro version, and you can easily, you can easily, uh, easily uh, redesign it with your own CSS code. So I think this is the very special feature, and these features are already loved by more than 500 customers so i hope that you you and your audience will love it so any question for me uh, okay so that was pretty much good and uh, you showed the feature of uh, the changing colors of text and uh, also we saw the os uh, operating system uh, aware uh, feature of this. Uh, one more thing, I think, uh, did you cover the time-based tag mode? Yes, oh, sorry. Maybe 
I'm not mm -hmm. covering the time based dark mode. Okay, so in short, we can uh, let me uh, let me uh, uh, let me uh, let me install the pro version so I can I'm able to describe all and every function from the okay. No problem. What you can do is that open Darklub website and uh, you can show the listed features over there. Okay, sure. Can you see? Yes, right now. So, this is the uh, this is our website, and I just gonna show you what is the main feature. I already described the web based dark mode. You see that a uh, website turned dark with the setting of your OS, so it works with Windows, uh, Windows, Linux, and Mac. So if your user uh, already have dark mode on their well, uh, on their uh, operating system if you install our plugin and active it uh, in your website it automatically turn dark and turn dark so and dark switch style this is the styling for the switches and you i already uh, present uh, to you that uh, there are several switches with the free version and also the premium version and you can also customize the every switch and switch setting with the uh, pro version and uh, with the free version you will get the three uh, three good quality uh, good quality switch for uh, for changing your dark mode and time based OS this is another excellent feature maybe I skipped previously and if you turn the time based dark mode that uh, you love uh, dark mode at night but you not love dark mode at your daytime so what should you do you can use the time based dark mode that uh, it is uh, think you uh, just evening start from the 6 pm so you dark uh, you set uh, set the plugin uh, timer to 6 pm to 7 am on dark mode the, in this time your website automatically in this web uh, your website automatically turn dark mode by default and also default dark mode is another another special feature that uh, in this feature allow you to use dark mode automatically without changing your design so uh, each and every visitor will see the dark a uh, dark version of your website dark version of your website but uh, when they uh, when they switch back to the light version they will see the uh, light version but you can use the dark uh, dark mode by default and this is the uh, this is the dark mode color scheme is uh, you have uh, already pre you can use the uh, 12 uh, 12 pre-mated uh, color scheme and you can also uh, code your own with this custom css and uh, ben's dark mode uh, ben's uh, backend dark mo dark mode is uh, uh, i already showed that the dark with the dark loop you can turn dark mode on on your back wordpress backend and also the front end so and plotting switch this feature uh, this features uh, i just show you with light you see that i am scrolling this uh, website but this dark mode switch plotting with uh, with scrolling so I just come with the footer, but the position of this uh, dark mode switch already been there. This is the uh, this is the floating switch and page builder. I already told that it is uh, compatible with Gutenberg, uh, Beaver Builder, JS Composer, DV, uh, DV, and the Elementor and some other others uh, others known and popular uh, popular page builder too. And so you can also define the custom colors. I am um, I'm now presenting you how the custom color 
work. See that I just change the color and okay. You see that in this portion, you see that I am in I just changing my color. So it changes automatically. So you can also uh, use any color that you want. And with the dark mood uh, image support, you see that if your light mood image is like that, you can, when you turn dark, then your, uh, then your light mood uh, image will be replaced with the dark version. So it's also the WooCommerce integrated and you can uh, use dark mood, dark mood uh, for your WooCommerce store and, and you can also the, uh, code your own with the custom CSS. So uh, I hope that uh, with all these features, you will gonna love this and uh, you also, uh, you also uh, try this plugin uh, and, and, and your feedback is also important. So if you find any issues or if you love it, please let us know so we can improve it in future and also improve uh, improve for uh, for the uh, better uh, for the betterment. Okay. Uh, so one more my question is that what is the difference between free and paid plan? What uh, what are the features that we don't get in free plan? Uh, so uh, there. Are there are huge feature already loaded in the free plan. You can change your color. You can uh, you use the you can use uh, use the OS based dark mode. You can use the front end and uh, back end dark mode. And you can also already uh, three color template for the uh, for uh, for uh, for back end for back end and front end. Uh, so there are. Uh, there are if you need the more customization if you need the more customization uh, like the replaces image uh, if you have oh. a store yeah uh, so you need to uh, uh, need to uh, com uh, make compatible your website uh, with your e-commerce store then you should go for the, uh, the uh, pro version but at least you should uh, try the free version so you can uh, use by yourself and uh, and you can also know uh, the basic features. Okay. Uh, so uh, I would like to ask about uh, speed because we got a one comment from user that will it affect page speed? No. This is this plugin is very much fast. It just uh, it just uh, uh, takes the twenty uh, thirty two kilobyte thirty two kilobytes. So it will total, total plugin size. Uh, no, it will increase page size just 32 kilobytes. It will okay. not defer the pages. I think that's uh, pretty much low. Uh, and uh, let's check this, guys. Uh, we have free version right now available in the WordPress repository. Just go to your WordPress website, install a free version, and test the speed difference yourself, and you will get everything clear in front of you. So uh, we have a few comments. Uh, we have from Vishnu that waiting for the upcoming plugins. So guys, stay tuned. Uh, we'll announce whenever the new uh, plugins will be launching. And uh, we have from Chaitanya. Hello, everyone. Hello, Chaitanya. That's awesome. OK. Guys, you can drop your questions inside the comment if you have any right now. So uh, that will be easy for us to. Aristotle told that looking nice so far. So uh, what we, uh, I, one, I have one question in my mind that uh, see, we have a WordPress website. We have two things inside WordPress. One is WordPress page and one is WordPress post. That is a, that is a blog post. Yeah. So this will apply to both, right? Yeah. With the free plugin, it will apply the both. If you want to exclude any uh, any post or pages from the uh, being dark, uh, dark mode, so you should uh, go for the uh, premium. Okay. So uh, what I'm asking is that uh, we are getting uh means once we activated the dark club in our wordpress website and we set up the basic setting then it will be make uh, my whole site will be dark mode right yeah, such yeah. as 
there is no difference between pages and blog posts, right? Yeah, right now uh, it will uh, not uh, make any difference with the uh, with the pages and posts. Uh, we have a comment 2 KB. Uh, it's not 2 KB. It's 32 KB, right? Yeah, right. Okay. So still 32 KB is a lot more lower size than most of the plugins because most of the plugins are, let's say, 400 or 500 KBs, right? Okay. Uh, so uh, that was pretty pretty much everything we covered. Anything you think you left about this? Oh, I think. Uh, uh... If your audience asks any question, I'm uh, I'm ready to answer them. Okay. And so discuss about and the roadmap and the features that are coming soon, uh, right? And which you are which are which is not passive, uh, available right now inside the plugin, but that are coming. Can you share if you have any roadmap or page ready? Uh, sorry, I can't hear you. Can you? Okay. Uh, plan or roadmap? Can you, do you have any ready roadmap that you can share with us? Yeah, sure. Actually, okay. we are. Uh, this product is already uh, been uh, loaded with the great features, but uh, we want to make this uh, uh, product more, uh, more, uh, more attractive and also more workable with your suggestion, with our research, and our uh, our feature plan is give the best service and also the finding the bugs and short it out and also solve it out our our research and development team already working for uh, for making uh, uh, adding more features we already update uh, update our free plugin today and uh, we already released some uh, good features uh, today so i hope that uh, we will continue uh, uh, develop uh, developing uh, our plugin continuously and also uh, we will uh, get uh, get um get a more feature in uh in it okay uh so i think that is pretty much everything and guys uh this was uh i was not able to made post about this live session in the morning so we do have a giveaway for dark club uh but what i would like to tell you that uh tell me tell us in the comment box what what type of giveaway it should be guys uh most of the people are asking for feedback. Most of the people are asking for multiple actions to take. So we ask you guys, what should be the way of this giveaway? Yeah, definitely. Audience are uh, audience are always uh, great. Are uh, and we also are very delightful to uh, uh, to select some uh, users. Select okay. some users uh, for we, our. We have a hand. Uh, uh, Sayyad from Sayyad Hussamuddin that is different filters going to come in future COS people okay uh, today use Instagram filters with colors mixing so is that possible uh, can you get the question can you read yeah yes. the different filter going come in future so uh, so uh, might be a uh, Sayyid Hussain uh, want to you know, want to know that is there any color or uh, color scheme will come in future am i right yeah i think uh, he's asking about that instagram has filter so we can mix different colors so uh, is there any plan to mix different colors in future uh, instagram has filter that is for the images uh, for images and we already have the color option you can use i already show you that showed that and okay. you can use so, any color so Husam, Sayyid Husamuddin, we already have uh, this feature live. You can test it out. Uh, just go to your WordPress website, go to free plugins repository, and you will find a free version over there of Dark Club. And you can install and test it. I don't know whether it's available in free plugin or not. Yeah, this free plugin is available. In, uh, uh, this this color, uh, color mixing feature is available in free plugin, right? Yeah. Uh, no, sorry, uh, sorry. Uh, with the free plugin, you can uh, you are not able to uh, mixing the color. Okay, so uh, Osamuddin, it's not available in the free version, but we have a special uh, lifetime deal just now running on AppSumo for the Dark Club, and you can get by just stacking two boards, you can get up to hundred website license, right? And if you stack three, you get thousand website license. So I think that's uh, pretty much enough for everyone. Either it's 
a person running multiple WordPress blogs or let's say agency having multiple WordPress clients, right? So the license uh, number of sites in the license is quite generous. And uh, I would like to uh, share, if you want to share the deal page, you can share right now or uh, we can just provide the link them in the comment box so they can visit. Yeah, so sure. we have a comment from uh, Aditya Sharma that uh, create one for non-WP sites as well. So oh. yeah, actually we are WordPress. Aditya, it's been a really pleasure that uh, you are asking uh, us in, the, in this. Actually we are WordPress based uh, company. So we have uh, no uh, no future plan right now to ship uh, to another uh, for another CMS. Right. Okay. So uh, for now, they don't have any plan from non-WP websites, but we know we don't know the future, right? Uh, we can request them and they build up a SaaS for all types of websites. Basically, what happens for non-WP websites, uh, every framework has different uh, way of working, right? So I think that I don't know if it's possible or not. Uh, we need to explore this site too. So Chetan is asking about roadmap. roadmap. So do you have any link for the roadmap? or the public uh, board for the roadmap uh, right now we are uh, we have no public roadmap right now we will uh, we are all uh, developing right now so we will release it publicly okay so uh, okay so chaitanya uh, they will i think create a link for the roadmap and that will be good because uh, you will get all of the feedbacks automated in automated way what will happen that users will be messaging you uh, separately all the users that will be a mess for you um, may i share my screen another time so i can uh, uh, show some uh, metrics uh, how uh, how the what uh, dark loop uh, making some great things okay so you can share i don't have any problem Okay. So your screen is live now. Okay. So this is the comparison, a comparison of WP Hive. This is the plugin comparison site, and you see that there is no problem. Memory use just seventy-eight kilobyte memory use, and average page speed loading is zero point one five second. This is faster than ninety-nine percent. Plugins. I hope your audience now are now being clear that this plugin is not uh, not hampered your page speed. That's a good thing. Uh, Aristotle screen was a uh, uh, screen. I, I think I made the screen big also. So we have a comment from Sayyad Usamuddin that need it for Webflow and Wix. Uh, so okay, that's not possible for right now. Uh, right now, Sayed, we will uh, we will thinking uh, with your proposal. So uh, we really appreciate that you uh, want this for the webflow and the Wix. We will uh, discuss with our team, and we also uh, we also uh, discuss uh, for uh, for the future plan. So okay. maybe one day we will release uh, uh, release it for webflow and Wix. Okay. So I think, uh, uh, guys, unfortunately, this uh, live stream was not, not announced previously. Even uh, it was supposed to be announced today morning, but uh, that was not possible. So uh, what we are doing that uh, if you are participating in the giveaway, then what you have to do is that uh, you must have a WordPress website and you have to install this free plugin, activate this on uh, your website, and send us a screenshot of your dark mode website inside the giveaway post. I will be posting the giveaway post inside the group. You will find the link below in the description. And we will pick up a random winner from the comments on the giveaway post. So guys, that's all for now. We'll meet in the next video for some other next amazing stuff also. So that's all for now. Nice. Uh, thank uh, we thank you a lot to come us uh, live with us and show us this uh, plugin so thank you for joining with us yeah, yeah. you are welcome and all, i also thank you uh, thank you uh, you uh, to invite me on your 
uh, on your live and i also thank you or uh, to your audience that they are very much passionate with this plugin they are uh, too much interested uh, to using it i hope they will get the uh, get the uh, get the best feature with uh, the dark loop and if the audience if the audience demand then we can make the, uh, some other future plan also so thank you guys uh, that's all for now and we'll meet in the next video and with the some amazing stuff then also so do participate in the giveaway join the group below uh, group lifetime deal group that is link is given in the description if you are not inside a group and look out for the post uh, my post in the next few minutes for the giveaway and you have to install the free version on your website and send us a screenshot of your website in the comment box thank and you guys for joining another thing that if you like this plugin to the audience if you like this plugin please uh, review a uh, review on uh, wordpress org and yeah guys uh, that 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 will help a lot and uh, you can also give feedback if you have any suggestion or you want to report any bug or anything you can directly contact to the team on their website dark club you will find a chat widget i think over there and uh, or or you can contact out the support team so guys thank you for joining we'll meet in the next session yeah